in my garden. Orchids don't grow very well in cool weather. And, and, and private school for three children? You make less than you think. Money is not the object here, Sophia. Respect is. Sacrifice for the good of one's education is very respectable. But father, what if I don't want to go? I'm top of my class and very, very popular. <laughs> <laughs> Sacrifice for the good of one's family is also very respectable. <laughs> what about the children's music lessons? I have them lined up at the San Francisco Conservatoire de Musique's advanced <laughs> team piano program. <laughs> Daddy, I don't really like the piano. I'm not very good at it. You're not very good at anything. What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> what about food? What are we going to eat in America? Uh, hamburgers all day? <laughs> There's only one paycheck in this family, and it comes from me. Whether to buy us chicken curry or chicken burgers. What about my father? I visit him every week. Your father has all sanders, for God's sake. <laughs> he won't know the difference. <laughs> now, this discussion is over. Let's stop dinner. <laughs> Speak and spell. We're moving to America. That means white people. I hear they're hairy, smell bad, and pronounce a lot of R's. <laughs> I hear they talk loudly and have a lot of sex on the street all the time. <laughs> They'll call us Yellow Peril, then put us in internment camps, shoot us dead with their AK 47s, and then eat us with fox and nuts. I see you're admiring the footprints, Poe. I put that up myself. Go on, read it out aloud. Footprints by Annie Anonymous. <laughs> <laughs> A man walks alongside the lot on the beach, making two sets of footprints. The footprints represent the man's journey through life. Suddenly, the man notices that during the hardest times of his life, there's only one set of footprints. He questions the Lord, Lord, why is it that during the hardest times of my life you abandon me and there's only one set of footprints? The Lord replies, Oh, this is my favorite part. <laughs> okay. The Lord replies, My child, during the hardest times of your life where you see only one set of footprints, I did not abandon you. It was then that I carried you. What an honorable poem. <laughs> oh, it's one of my favorites. Is it one of your favorites? They don't have this poem in Singapore. America's God seems much nicer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are adorable. <laughs> By the way, I'm Miss Pips, your vice principal. You must be Gwendolyn. Gwendolyn, what a beautiful oriental name. <laughs> <laughs> are you Filipino or Korean? <laughs> I'm 
Singaporean. <coughs> oh, I've never been to China. <laughs> oh, Singapore's not in China. It's a little island in Southeast Asia. You're from the third world. Yeah. <laughs> How meaningful. We are honored to have you here. <laughs> now, are you ready to take your placement test? What is 10 minus 9? 1. What is the past tense of is? Was. Who was our first American president? George Washington. Congratulations. <laughs> you have now passed math, English, and history. <laughs> Not only that, you've done well enough to skip the sixth grade. <laughs> now, although you clearly haven't hit puberty exemplified by your very flat dressed, your mind seems ready for the seventh grade. Your homeroom teachers, Mr. Plink, room 104. And Gwendolyn, welcome to America. <laughs> Levi's 501 button fly. Oh, you'll get there one button at a time. An American brand you can trust with the hottest fly in town. Mmm. Speak and spell. Did I tell you about my homeroom teacher, Mr. Plink? He's tall, speaks his mind, and has bright blue eyes. He's six feet of the hunky white man. <laughs> That's right. Levi's 501 jeans are what you want. Come and get it at your nearest department store. Oh my what? generously allowed my mother to have a third, even though we were taxed much more heavily. <laughs> now from this day forth, I will set out to prove my value. On the other hand, if I cause further distress, I will be cut out of this family. Sign and date. <coughs> Teddy, I feel so ashamed. When did this become about your feelings? This is about a family. Now sign and date. And for goodness sake, your piano auditions are next week. For once in your life, find a way to shine.
Um, <clears throat> to the judges out there, I, I'd like to say something. I, I've been in America a few months now, and I really like it here. My brother tells me this is the land of the free and the home of the brave, so I'd like to be brave and tell you the truth that I hate the piano. <laughs> <laughs> but I do love music, and I was hoping that if you do accept me to your prestigious program, that I could be free to choose my own instrument. Maybe if I played something I liked, I could really shine at it. Send it back to the conservatory. Your father and I did not, did not waste all that money on piano lessons so you could play this weird string thing. <laughs> oh, it's a Chinese zither, Mom. Usually Chinese folk songs are played on it, but I thought I could put my own spin to it, see? Isn't it like the Asian version of Pink Floyd? <laughs> Don't you want to smoke a weed listening to this? <laughs> Why would anyone be well, smoke a weed? Well, one of the judges said that and everybody laughed. I don't know. Anyway, can I play this instead of the piano mom? Don't ask me. Ask the king. <laughs> <clears throat> My father agreed to the Chinese zither. He said, the more we were in America, the more Chinese we had to be. <laughs> Beat them to the punch. Remind <sighs> them before they remind us. <laughs> Remember, we didn't come here to be American. We came here to be successful. In Singapore, we never had to think about being Chinese. We were the majority. The Filipinos, the Malays, the Indians, basically anyone darker skinned than us, they were the minorities. Suddenly, in America, we were the minorities. There were actually people lighter skinned than us. <laughs> Speaking of Sproul, why is it that when you shake the world, the darkest colors seem to settle at the bottom? The world was not created this way. This kind of human sedimentation is perverse and unjust. It makes me S-A-D sad. The color of my skin started to glow a bright yellow. In private, it didn't glow. But in public, all I could think about was how yellow my skin was. Over the next two years, I did everything to stop my skin from glowing. What? What is up, girlfriend? What is up, girlfriend? Girlfriend. What is up, girlfriend? Does that sound American enough? What's wrong with your Singaporean accent? European accents are sexy. Asian accents make people point and laugh. Oh, look at these hideous glasses. Ugly braces and booplessness. You look perfect to me. You don't get it, speak and spell. This is high school. I'm sorry I can't take you to school with me. If kids see me, see me carrying you around, they'll totally make fun of me. I'm an easy fit in your Eddie Bauer backpack. But <laughs> if you choose not to have me, I have to respect that. <laughs> Why are you making this so difficult? I'm already the biggest freakazoid in the freshman class. <sighs> I gotta go. I will be here waiting for you to come home to me. Okay, you need to stop 